So if you watched any of my test driving videos with the OpenRC F1 car, this is probably the car you've seen and you may have noticed that the body has uh, a two color scheme and when you download the files from Thingiverse or any other site and just print them, this is what you'll get, which is a one color body. But there is a zip file together with the other files as well, which is called dual color or something, I think. And it contains all the parts for a dual color body. And it, from the beginning, it's designed to be printed using dual extrusion, like with the Sigma behind me here. But you can also, if you want, print all the parts separately and use them, just push them in place like like this one. So the one I have to the right of me and the one in the Sigma, they're all printed with the parts separately and just push them in place. This works really well uh, if you print it in PLA, but if you use other materials like ABS or nylons, for example, it may be hard to fit them in place and you may have to cut off the sides with a knife or something similar. So I think if you want to print a OpenRC F1 car, do check out the dual extrusion version and don't be intimidated by the dual extrusion thing. You can print all the parts separately uh, to get a really nice look and color scheme of the car. So go check them out. There are Thingiverse, Pinshape and uh, GrabCAD and all the other sites as well. And uh, so that's it. That's it for this video. Go check out the files. Have a great Easter and I'll see you in the next video.